All right, number 28, it says, which angles are less than angle three below? Now, this goes off of the idea of the exterior angle theorem, which basically this exterior angle is going to be equal to this angle plus this angle. Well, if it's equal to those two angles added, it's got to be equal. It's got to be bigger than each one of them individually, right? I mean, if you think about it, this is 100 and this was 80 and 20 because 80 plus 20 adds up to 100. The 100 has got to be bigger than the 80 and the 20. It's bigger than each one of them individually. So they're talking about angle three here. So what's he the exterior angle to? Well, first I see he's the exterior angle to this. And meaning he's equal to five plus nine. Angle five plus angle nine has to add up to angle three. Meaning angle three is bigger than angle five and is bigger than angle nine. But that's not the only exterior angle that he is to. You could also look at him being right here, couldn't you? Yes, with that triangle, three is, is equal to seven plus these two together in that corner. So we know it's bigger than seven by itself and bigger than the nine and 10. We've already listed nine though, and there's 10. And that's the only piece that it's an exterior angle to. So those are the only four we know that angle three is larger than or less than. Those angles, these guys are less than angle three, or angle three is larger than those guys. However you want to word it is fine.